Christians often say that God came down to earth and lived among mankind in part in order to understand our sufferings, what we go through, and to be able to empathize with us. Uh, but I don't see that as being possible. <clears throat> Think about this. God comes down to earth in the form of Jesus, who I guess is a different person, but the same person. But anyway, he suddenly finds himself in a human body, but he's unable to sin, which automatically, right off the top, precludes tons of human emotions and human um, situations that he could never experience. He could never experience guilt. Guilt is an emotion that stems from the acknowledgement and recognition that you've done something wrong, something against your own sense of morality. That couldn't happen with Jesus. Jesus could not experience guilt. He doesn't know what it's like. We know guilt, but Jesus can't and couldn't have and did not experience guilt. You can take the same idea and go through all of these uh, types of emotions and um, situations and pretty quickly you'll discover that Jesus probably didn't experience 1% of all of humanity, the things that we suffer and the things that we experience, uh, things that <clears throat> he would never, ever be able to truly experience and say, I know what you're going through. He doesn't know what it's like to betray somebody, to lie to somebody. He doesn't know what it's like to steal a piece of bread or some money from somebody. We could also think about all of the modern situations that he, he didn't have a chance to experience because he came to earth in, in a primitive time so, think about that. Jesus and God, too. And the Holy Spirit? I don't know. All three of them could never know, truly know, what I've suffered. Jesus could not have panic attacks, severe panic attacks, debilitating panic attacks. That would mean that he had something wrong in his psychological machinations and that couldn't happen. Jesus could never know what it was like to go through a horrendous divorce, separation, anything revol involving uh, marriage because we assume that he never got married. That wasn't his purpose in coming to the earth. And we can take this and just keep going on and on and on. But the bottom line is, Jesus does not know me. He does not know what I've been through. He does not know what you've been through. And he cannot empathize with the majority of human suffering. Roll that one around for a while. Later.